Notice how Cheetah scratches an itch in his ear. He uses a, uh, a screw. Here, let me help you, Kenji. Get, let me help you. My knuckle. It makes you wonder if Cheetahs in the wild use old screws to clean their ears. Feel better, buddy. That's a bit better. I can use the old rusty, rusty old screw to do that, huh? You're gonna cut your ear. Hey, buddy. All joking aside, it shows the advantage captive animals have when it comes to medical care. There aren't any veterinary clinics in the wild, and certainly not someone there to scratch an itch. Once you hit the right spot, these cheetahs just melt. Cheetahs. Incredible. Relaxer here. Good. Oh, that feels good. Yeah, that feels good. Oh, that feels good. Yeah, that feels good. Now watch this. This is uh, scratching a cheetah's ear that itches. I know her ear itches because he's been trying to scratch it. So, I'm going to help her along. This is Faith. She can't scratch. She can't move her, her, look at her legs. Look at that. Scratch like a dog. Look at that. The cheat scratches like a dog. I'm just gently massaging the inside of her ear because it's bothering her. I put medication on her outside of her ear to keep the, the flies off so there's no flies on her. But uh, isn't that interesting? A dog, they have that same reflex as a dog that uh, when you scratch something, it uh, itches. It's a reflex response. All right, Faith. She says yes, in a purr language. I don't, I don't want to do it too much because it might bother her too. Look at that. That leg going. Well, it's got to feel good. She can't do it herself. Wait a minute. Let's scratch her ear. Scratch the other ear. It needs to be cleaned out really. If it's, if it's that itchy, then maybe, who knows, fungus. I'll, I'll report it. And maybe a fungus is in there or something, or mites, who knows. Their ears. But there again, it's a tamed animal that I can actually give medical care to uh, due to the fact that it has been hand raised, hand tamed, and humanized, basically. All right, Faith, I can do all kinds of things to help you out. One more ear scratch and purr. I feel better, sweetie? This is Neo. He's got an itch when I try to find it. So I can't get it. Scratch like a dog. It's somewhere here. Oh, she purrs. Wait, almost had it. See her legs trying to move. Strong bite. Yeah, so I'm gonna it. That's her somewhere. See that? She's got it. I don't know where. Oh, there it is. I found it. They're about ear. Having an itch scratched is a rewarding experience. Oh, she rest. Petting, scratching, and relieving an itch are just more layers to successfully bond with an animal. They remember how you made them feel. If you're consistent and repetitive about it, they will learn to love you for it. That goes for any animal, but especially for cats who see grooming as a social ritual. Once you've reached a tactful trust with an animal, then you both can relax. If you like this video, please share it and give the thumbs up. And consider joining my channel.
join my coalition. <laughs>